But, um, like, it's just, it's hard out here, but you got to still just, mm, just remember, <laughs> hold on. All right, but that's what I'm saying. I know life is hard, you feel me? Life gonna be hard. It's gonna be hard trying to, trying to, you feel me, find your inner self, trying to, you feel me, trying to find your peace of mind, especially in America. I mean, I'm pretty sure, I don't know where you at, but everywhere is crazy nowadays. You just gotta try to stay out the way, or if you in a way, stay out the way. That's all I can tell you. But, um, uh, I ain't really good of a speaker, but, <laughs> so you feel me, if I mess up, I get, we just gonna keep going on with it, let it roll. But, um, as I was saying, like me, me being a Rasta, it's, I love it, you feel me? I love it. More people want to get to know more about me, like, what made me do it, like, how'd I come across it, because it's like, it's something different, but it's something relative to everyone because everyone can relate to it because everyone would want that same feeling, that same passion. You, that, that's that's what it is. So it's like, you feel me? I'm I'm glad to I'm glad to be there because you feel me? You got any questions? You can come see me. And like I said, you don't have to be Jamaican or whatever to become a Rasta. It's just majorly known over there because we ain't got a lot in Babylon over here but just because you live here don't mean you got to follow the ways but um like see me I'm still doing my my natty my natty dread thing my locks is still natural all of that so I'm not tripping over that I'm gonna still do me regardless but like me my peace of mind this is what I do my peace of mind I'm a I roll up, I smoke a joint, you feel me? I smoke the I smoke the herbs. I don't I use it, I don't abuse it, you feel me? That's one thing you gotta know. Don't abuse it. But um I like every time before I smoke, I don't just you feel me, I don't do it for fun, like just a clown all the time. It's it's more like something spiritual. So every time before I smoke, I pray. When I pray, I say the roster prayer. If y'all don't know what that is, I'm gonna see if I can um either you can look it up or I uh write it on the, I'll write it on here, you feel me? Show y'all what the prayer is. As I do it, you feel me, and then listen to some reggae. Most likely Bob Marley, Jacques Care, Vibes Cartel, you feel me? Some of them. But Back to what I was saying though, like that's what gives me my state of mind. I don't just, I don't smoke weed to, to have fun. I don't even call it weed. You feel me? I call it ganja. I call it the tree of life. You feel me? Cause it's, it's like it's cleansing yourself. It's, it's, it's bringing you closer to Jah, for real. But um, yeah, that's just that's my method. You feel me? But um, another thing about me being a, a Rasta in, in Babylon, they eating, man. It ain't like I'm in in Jamaica or Africa. They eating, it's like, <laughs> everybody eat meat, you feel me? So, mm, that's the hard part. Like, I've been eating chicken ribs and all that all my life. Like, damn. But I understand where they're coming from. You feel me? Just because I ate it don't mean I can't, I can't not eat it. It just takes some time. But I understand. You feel me? It's like, like me. I'm not gonna say I'm a full vegetarian. I'm not a full vegetarian. But I don't eat red meat. You feel me? Like I can eat whatever. I just don't eat the scavenger foods. Like you feel me? Like the animals that would be considered scavengers, like pigs, stuff that. Animals that eat off the ground, you feel me, that feed on dead, like, you feel me, because you eating that, that's just like making a, a cemetery for your body, like, you just killing yourself, like, these foods are really bad out here for us, I'm pretty sure anybody that know, that know, would tell you, you feel me, 
But um, yeah. So right now, you feel me? I'm eating oranges and I have fruits. Ain't nothing wrong with fruits, you feel me? Fruits good regardless. You should be eating fruits in your own natural habit anyway. But um, damn, another. But uh, yeah, eating healthy is just. I eat. So, my mom, I guess she's going to consider helping me out on this. So, I don't, like, breakfast, I used to eat eggs, fucking bacon, all that. And, like, now I'm chilling out. I eat the little apples on the side, you feel me, with either pancakes or waffles, but no eggs, no bacon. I got the, um, the veggie, the veggie, uh, the veggie sausage. There you go. But, um, tofu, I got to get this mess with that <laughs> so I'm not even on that level yet for real for real but let me fix this up oh man mm. fuck that but um as I was saying hey you just gotta stay committed to the to the diet you feel me I'm gonna keep you updated on on how it goes so far I've been going no meat, uh, you can eat fish, as long as it's not more than 12 inches, you feel me, it's cool, but I've been doing good for like, a uh, good month and a half now, like, like, you can say that's short, but that's good as hell for and somebody like me, you feel me, but, um, yeah, like, it's just all healthy eating, you feel me, the healthier, the better your body is, and then, you feel me? You, you, you smoking the the tree of life. It's just all that. Why do you think Ross's hairs be so long? They're so healthy. Like they're eating good, and then they're smoking ganja at that. It's like you just you're putting good into your body. Like don't say weed is bad. Who who you know had cancer from weed? Like you feel me? So I'm not even gonna get on that. But yeah, it's just you're you're. Process live forever. You just making yourself just. This is just a vehicle for us. Like we'll just move on, you feel me, and come back. Like we never die. We just. That's the way to go. That's the way of life. It's just. Alright. Alright. I'm not falling in the ways of Babylon. That's. I would say that's the hardest part though. Cause. I mean, on this job thing, like, you having locks, natural locks at that, you know, dreads is like the most looked down upon hairstyle in the job industry, you feel me? So it's like, oh man, <laughs> it's hard out here, but you gotta just, you feel me? Like, people, oh man, like I told you, I'm, I grew up on the block, so if anything, I go to selling weed. You feel me? But I don't want to move to that because I know where that will lead. I don't want to start that up again. It's just, it's doing, it's doing too much. You feel me? But people out here, they don't understand. Like, you can, you can be a roster. You feel me? And not follow the ways of Babylon. You can. So don't, don't let that fool you. You feel me? Just follow me. <laughs> And you, you know the way of life. But, um, all that is good on, god damn, 18, uh, <laughs> yeah, man, just, I'm just talking about basically just how I came into it, because that's, I feel like it's right for me, it's like, I feel at home, I feel like, I feel better. I feel like I'm at peace for real. Like everything that they talk about is like, I understand. You feel me? As long as you could back up what you're saying, I'm gonna understand you. I'm gonna feel you. I'm gonna, you feel me? And I know where you're coming from. And everybody should. Everybody. I'm not trying to convince you to do it, but if you are interested in becoming a roster, man, you feel me? Just take the time. You feel me? Look what I'm talking about. Look what it's done to me. You feel me? I'm, I'm out here. You. But I'm a still I'ma still be me regardless. I'ma still be doing me. I'm not gonna let it change me, you feel me? I know I'ma try my 
be at my peace of mind and everything, but I'm gonna still be me. I'm gonna still be. I'm not going. It's not like you do this wrong, you gonna go to hell. Like uh, it's not like that. You feel me? It's just. Oh man, it's just. It's best to live like this. It's all a positive vibe. It's always been a positive vibe. Reggae, all that. That, and it's from your roots. Like who want one be from their roots? Who want one to know more about where they came from? You feel me? Like, I'm only speaking the real. That's what I came here to do. I can't give y'all false advertisement on YouTube. That's, nah, man. That's not what I'm here for. You feel me? I'm going to still be a rapper regardless. I'm going to still do hip-hop, but I'm going to do reggae, too, at the same time. Hopefully, if I get big off this, I'm going to be featuring other reggae artists, and they be featuring me. Like, you feel me? Like, I'm trying to start a whole new thing here. Like, reggae and hip-hop together. You see... Ross is on BT or Bob Kimani Marley on beat. Like, you feel me? Something just trying to start a whole new vibe. You feel me? The more people that would look into it, the more things would change in life. Like, you feel me? You just got to keep fighting. Don't just stand up. Like Bob Marley said, you feel me? He really an inspiration. Like, I'm just trying to show y'all the right way to go. But I'm going to wrap this up. You feel me? But all I just want to say is, you feel me? It's always, it's always good to know where you came from. Don't never forget where you came from, ever. You feel me? Cause you don't want to be lost. And if you are, you feel me? At least you know you real from the roots. I think I might get that tatted. <laughs> yeah. All right. One well, love. Uh, stay tuned for my next uh, American roster video. Can't tell you when yet, but. Keep subscribing, you feel me? You'll get an update from me, but all right, peace. Job blessed.